Hello and welcome back to European Versailles 4 to uh, my, my Merchant of Venice game which is going horribly horribly wrong because um, my allies are rubbish. I think part of me... Oh, I can't believe these rebels rose up in Zagreb and just destroyed destroyed my men. Absolutely destroyed them. Uh, which is unfortunate. We've got some more men we're growing, building up here, we'll go and take out these Tuscans and then think about what to do with these Zagrebians. And once this is at it, I'm... Part of me is tempted to, to wander up here and um, pick up these armies, Lithuania, Lithuanian armies, and just kind of wander in against these the Hungarians. The Hungarians just seem to win easily. Uh, they're not me, are they? Although, I know, I'm getting confused by... Bohemia looks much like Mazovia, which looks remarkably like Poland. Oh, Poland are coming some more. If we can time this, if I can, you know, stop sieging that. I haven't got a leader on this army, which is a problem, and I can't get one because I have to go into Blumen Zagreb and they have a very good leader who destroyed all my troops before so what we need to do is hopefully use these ten join up with these so attach this unit yes pick up these these uh, is there a oh, Krakow in the mountains Mainly plains, got some woods, some hills, some marsh, not many mountains. Uh, you are... You've only got one, one, one. So, yeah, it might be possible with those ten, along with these ten, to overwhelm them in terms of numbers. What kind of... What have you got left in terms of manpower, Hungary? Because I'm quite low, I've only got 4,000 left. What have you got left? Are we are we wearing you down? Is basically what I'm suggest asking. Manpower 153. Yes. Wow. They only have 16 left. Five, six, seven. That's it. Is that? That's all they've got. Is that? Ah. Okay. Yes. You are coming up to here. We're going to try and get this. Mm, you're winning the siege of Krakow. You don't want that because you might get Poland to peace out. And I wouldn't want that. So let's go. This is this is audacious. Uh, Brittany has uh, cancelled military access. It's fine. If only Austria were my allies. If only. They'd probably do it now if I wasn't at war. Oh, my manpower is just so low. But when these are, we can just take the Tuscans. Why are you breaking? No, attach! Pegasus, okay. No, I want you to. Look! Battle of the Shapes of Otranto. Oh no, I lost. Oh, hello. Eight. Where are my galleys? Where are my galleys? Did I lose my galleys? Holy shit, you've got to um, go in because you are going to get massacred by that. And my little land bridge is also have to go, go in. Land bridge, water bridge, little bridge. Uh, but you can merge. Oh god, they got transport to there, haven't they? Eight. Shit. Aragorn are bringing troops now. So I didn't really want that to happen. Okay, you're going to stay there. 
to 11. Um, force blockaded. It's fine, and you're walking seven, seven across to to Venice. Oh yeah, yeah, just Venice. Uh, let's destroy these, and then try and destroy these, and then die. I think it's probably the option that is going to be most suited because of bloody Aragorn. So I'm going to lose Venice really quite quickly. Yeah. See, we can't even beat that. We can't even beat Tuscans with two men. Oh no, we did. Are you running away again to a place that you're gonna? See, you is over. We won the Battle of Lika. Licker. Okay, we're now being sieged. If we go in here, we're gonna get massacred. Siege of Krakow is over. Where are you going? You're going to Ruthenia on the 25th. Is there any way I can get you to join? Oh, you're going to here. Fantastic. Uh, what have you got? You've got a one. Two. But no cannons. Great. You are going to get there on the 3rd of January. Uh, we are going to go across now. Come on. Come on, before you die, before you die, before you die, before you die. Come on. Hold out a bit longer. Hold out a bit longer. Hold out a bit longer. Can you get there? Yes! Come on. They're negative. Their leader is only 111. Our leader is on 1 minute 002. Come on. Oh. So we lost that. Oh no, our morale's gone up a bit. Roll Nate, that's good. Oh, they're losing, they're losing. We could win this one. This would be this would be big. Come on. I rolled a zero. Great. We need another dice roll. Now. A six. Equal. Oh. We won. A piece offer from Hungary. We received an offer of peace from Hungary. They are for some white peace. Right. Right. Given that Aragon is finished with their war and are sitting in Venice, that they have twelve thousand men outside there. I am down to two thousand manpower. Uh, and hardly any troops left. I want one more prestige, though. Um, I think we're gonna, to, we're gonna have to accept. Uh, I think that was great. This thing is Zagreb is still held by rebels. You reckon they could Croatia rise? Because that'd be good. Right. It was a massive disaster. I should never have done it. But I've got out of it with a white piece. Which is quite lucky. Uh, I can disband you. Should put me back underneath my force limit. Because I was above my force limit. Wasn't I? Uh, force limit. Yeah, I'm back at my force limit now. Let me just let our manpower and everything grow back up again. We're out of the war. And we can rebuild. And now... You would... You would... You would alliance ally with us. Austria. I would love it if you did. That's even more fun. I know I got it five years truce because it's a white piece. Perfect. Oh! You beauties. Now I have you. Would you like to go to war against the Ottomans? Not just yet. Naples, everything is back. I need to... Um, actually, they should be out. Patrolling my light ships again. Oh no, I had 11 ship. I had 11 here! I forgot I put them in there to repair. I could have defended up here. Oh, never mind. Uh, come home.
Damn it. I need to get called into a war so I can get my prestige up. Importing iron. We keep we strive to keep the Venetian military strong. Yes we do, it's very important. Well, modern and domestic domestically supported. Modern and domestically supported. But sometimes our priorities end up in conflict with each other, lacking the rich iron mines of our neighbours. Some of our grander plans for future military development will not be possible as soon as we might wish. Increasing support imports is a tempting option, but relying on foreign support might compromise our trade policies. Although a knight in the back of our neighbour would be all the more brilliantly insidious if made from their own steel. We need imported iron for our fist, uh, 40 military power and plus 20 relationship with Austria is always nice. Or mercantilism. <coughs> um, what is our mercantilism? And where do we find our mercantilism? Uh, mercantilism. It's going to be government. I never know where to find this. I never know. Uh, merchant steering, no. Merchant plus what's because I've got there. Uh, mercantilism. Where would you be? Increasing nationalists are a bit pissy. I don't know where mercantilism is. Trade. No. Oh, mercantilism. Uh, provincial trade power plus 20. Mm. Uh, we'll go with um, 40 military power and a little bit from there because we might need a harsh treatment. Uh, where was it? 3.5. 4.3. 4.3. You might need a harsh treatment here with 50 military power. Because you're an iron. You're a pain in the ass. Yeah, heart treatment thing, Crete. Corfu, maybe not as hard to get to. Or maybe not as big, it's not likely to have as many people rise up. So we won't waste points there. Oh, Moria, Achia would be lovely, Epirus would be beautiful. Are the, um, they are at war with Ramazan and Kandar. I'm not sure they should win that. There's Kandar, and um. Oh, I don't war those two. Oh, it's nothing. But I think we need to sit and wait for a bit. Oh, I wish. I need a um. I need a mission that will, or an event that gives me prestige. Because, um, oh, I'm making money again. How much am I making? 0.9. Oh, yeah, I need to replace my ships. Uh, let's build some barks. One, two, three, four, five, six. I lost six, so I'll build six. We have no manpower. We're not going to war right now. Oh, I need some prestige. You're just going to stay there. What are you going to do? What are you going to do if you, um, when they come for you? Oh no. Oh, you're going to attack them. And you're going to run away. Ah. Oh, you got river crossing. But you got high morale. Uh, with the generous liberties we grant our merchants, we've ended up with a situation where they simply don't want to be honest anymore. Oh, well, that's great. Lose a bit of money. Oh, that's not too bad. God, if you could, if you could release Croatia or something, as I was planning to do my war anyway, that would be amazing. I don't know if that's what you'd do, because you are, you're Hungarian pretender. Okay, so you'll probably just split the country up or take it over or something. But you're going to lose anyway, so that's not worth worrying about. What are you making? Point two? Nothing. Why are we making so little now? Oh, we've got mercenaries, haven't we? Yeah, three mercenary groups. Uh, we disband you because you're too expensive. Any mercenaries here? No. So all our mercenaries are gone. We should increase our money. Oh, you might actually win. Oh, hungry in a really bad way. 
five years. Well, they, I haven't got a manpower. That's the problem. I don't have the manpower either. Because they don't have the manpower, but I don't have the manpower. And they lost. Wow. But now I have Austria on my side. <gasps> oh, Salzburg has um, become independent, as has Augsburg. Interesting. I knew you're still... Oh, you're a vassal of Aragon. Aragon is vassalizing Italy. That is not good. And you're allied with Hungary and Portugal. I mean, just just as a... Austria would come. Uh, yeah, it's not, not a stupid... Well, it probably is a stupid idea. Um, probably one of the worst ideas I've had. But, you know, it's an idea. Come on, shit, let's build. Oh, we can probably up to... Three now. Uh, Sweden has declared war on Novgorod. You like being at war in Novgorod, don't you? Where is Novgorod? Not Sweden is quite big, and you are right next to Novgorod, so yeah, it's kind of understandable. So you, oh, you're now sieging Varsovia. Major Josh uh, that you come to their aid in the Holy Roman intervention against Ulm. This is the war that they have started. Ulm is allied with Baden, Bavaria. Oh no, Switzerland. Um. Yep. Yeah. Does that mean we're no longer allies of Switzerland? It does. That's disappointing, but, you know, understandable. Um. Oh, hang on a second. Prestige. Yes. Right, no leader. Put my leader on this one. You. Come here. See if we can get in some battles and get some prestige to get this mission done. Who are you? Augs oh, Augsburg? Who am I fighting against? Ulm, Baden, Bavaria and Switzerland. Okay, we're, we're on the side of Augsburg, Brandenburg, Trier. Uh, okay. Okay. Ulm, Baden, Bavaria and Switzerland. Well, we'll just try and get some war score with Switzerland then. A little bit of sieging. Maybe, um. Help you out as well. Uh, okay. Um. I can't really do much in this war, but. Yeah, it'll be a bit of fun. And if I could get some prestige from it somehow, if I can find a battle I can join. Anyone? Anne's back? Were they? No, it's Ulm? Baden. Bavaria? Yes. Smoosh these. They have a 3 1 1, but I've got to. F we'll get some help from Austria. 30 December. Yes! Ha! <laughs> I knew there's a good reason for this this war. Election! It turns out for Alfredo Trevisano. Uh, we must support he can stay in office, but then he must be... Uh, we still only have 85. I don't want to lose any more, but we will go with um, Giuseppe. Do you want bureaucrat, diplomat, or military? Uh, I think... Uh, oh... Go diplomat this time. Work on some different techs. I won, I got my 5% prestige. I lost a few cavalry, it's not too bad. We have increased our stability. Uh, my doge, our government situation has improved, causing our realm stability to increase. Fantastic! New ruler, Marco Bardolino. Uh, has great cunning and silver tongue. Today he's forming strong alliances with our friends, which is important at the moment because we are very, very weak on our own. Uh, we are. Oh, this is good. We. 
have no mission selected. Conquer Cyprus is the mission I wanted. Because it gives me a CB on Cyprus. Which I want and need. Although they are protected by the Mamluks. But the Mamluks can't get there if I have naval superiority. Which I believe I should have. See how the Mamluks are doing with their navy. And always remember that it's the Mamluks, not just Mamluks. The Mamluks, 16 galleys, 10 light ships. Okay, they got a little bit more than me, but we can build up. I've got 19 galleys. Have we? Wow. Oh yeah, I got those 8 and those 11. How are we doing for our ship limit? You've built another 4 galleys as well. Ah. Oh, we got a light ship there. Oh, yeah. Um, light ships come out to the Gulf of Venice. I'd like to select the light ship. You come out to the Gulf of Venice. Uh, we're winning this war quite easily. Uh, I don't really need to go into any more battles, do I? I don't want to lose any men because I still don't have any manpower. Uh, we've already got another little one there. I'll probably just... I mean, this is mountains, right? Mountains, yes. And this has got our... we got two manoeuvre, so we should find a very good place to fight. So we should be safe just sitting up in here. We're not going to be able to take it, unfortunately, because uh, we're not able to take, make our own peace. I don't believe. Oh, no, I can. I can't. I doubt I'll be able to get anything. Because oh, I quite like that. Yeah, it's another area. It produces uh, wool in the mountains. Mountain wool. Lovely mountain wool. And right, getting our trade fleet back together. Oh, I didn't want all of you to come out. Didn't want the transports. Uh, pause. Uh, merge. Only five? I've had six. It is a light ship. Ah, uh, yes. Who are you? You are... Oh! Six light ships. Oh, because we're at war again. Um, but we don't need to worry about that. Because we're at war with people who don't actually have a navy. So, the fact... We're not going to get attacked by navies. Oh, who? Holy Roman intervention. Take Constans. Where's Constans? Here. Oh no, he's actually trying to take Constans. Fine. We'll take Constans for you then. Along with Grabmundin. Who are you? You are Baden. Oh, okay. You're Switzerland. Well, I'm feeling pretty confident sitting in these mountains here. Especially if... Uh, where are you going? Uh, okay, maybe not so confident now. They are... That was... After the fall of Constantinople, large amounts of Greek and Albanian soldiers joined the cause of the Venetian Republic to fight against the Ottomans. Oh, thank you. Uh, they were called Stratioti, coming from the Greek word for soldier, and were feared like cavalry. One of their most noble leaders was Gracias Apalibulde, fellow of Byzantium until 1461. Gained 10 iron tradition, 10,000 manpower. Oh, you beauty. You absolute beauty. That will help me take um, Cyprus. Uh, but what I do want to do is I want to build some more galleys. I can build, what, three more? Where's it going to be quickest? Uh, one, two, three. That's my limit. Um, I would like you to... Uh, oh, I'll select this one. I want you. And 
with you, and then we'll split you up and patrol the Gulf of Venice. Bavaria, are you coming to attack me? Uh, four. Here's my five. No leader. We might have to move you if they can start coming in. Which they might do. And I got another big stack here, and they're going to smoosh them up there. That's fine. Oh, 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 okay, now they got reinforcements. Okay, you two. Merge. Protect trade in Venice. Still say if they won that, that's fantastic. We're up to 10%. Still don't hold this. Switzerland, 2,000 men. So many armies. So many. Oh, I'm still disappointed by our... Oh, look at that. They're, they're taking over, these pretenders. Oh, no, they're all over here. I, that was a, it was a silly... I think it was a silly move to go into Hungary. We've broken Hungary, and they're being pretended upon. I'll leave you there as my kind of bridge to get to everywhere. It was a mistake to go after Hungary. It really was. But, you know, things worked out okay. We got our white piece, which was probably the best we could hope for. And... It's enabled us to... We completed our mission as well. What's, oh no. Seriously? Uh, what? What is the war goal? Is he going to tell me here? It is the... Ottoman conquest of Serbia. Okay, it's up there. Ottomans and Athens just to get this Bosnia. Oh dear. These Ottomans are getting a little bit big. I like the Mamluks to start attacking them if they, if they could. Oh, I've eaten through that manpower I had. Yeah, you're going to siege. Right, what are you? Uh, pause. You are pretty much all mountains as well. So, we'll just use that one as well. No point in not. If you're pretty much all mountains, it's quite safe to stand there. Oh, one Elsass as well. Destroying that. Lovely. I'm still safe here. My six men, and I'm going to take the war goal. I don't think that means anything, really. Apart from, I feel like I'm doing something. Which is always nice. Uh, Switzerland are creating three more units. It's fine. Uh, we've got mem 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 memingham And, whoa, this is time to end this episode. It's gone on far too long. Uh, I was having so much fun actually winning a war for once. Helps me got Austria on your side, I suppose. And, you know, things... Apart from... Yeah, apart from the Ottomans taking more, it's a problem. Uh, so yeah, thank you for watching. Uh, come next time, where we will take more of, well, we won't take any of it, I don't think, but you know, we'll, we'll do have some more fun. So thank you for watching, come next time, and goodbye. <laughs>